My latest story is on how Atlanta Breakfast Club emerged as the city's premier breakfast establishment. Founded in 2016, this black-owned business went from barely scraping by to now a Yelp favorite, especially amongst tourists looking for a quality meal during their time in Atlanta. Chef Anthony Sanders and co-owner Osiris Ballard together have built a team dedicated to good food and Southern hospitality. The menu features Chef Sanders' spin on Southern classics like chicken and waffles, shrimp and grits, and peach cobbler French toast, amongst others. Their flagship location sits on Ivan Allen Jr. Boulevard, directly across from the Georgia Aquarium. And on any given day, the line is out the door. The massive success of their original location has spawned the opening of their second location, Atlanta Breakfast Club Chicken and Waffles Nitro Coffee Counter. Located on historic Auburn Avenue, the new location features a condensed menu centered around the chicken and waffles and a new phenomenon, nitro coffee. Now you're probably wondering, what the hell is nitro coffee? Just imagine taking an Arnold Palmer and converting it into coffee without the coffee taste. It's next level. Good food and nitro coffee aside, Atlanta Breakfast Club is bringing economic viability back onto the once flourishing block of Black Atlanta a place where Dr. Martin Luther King and many other prominent civil rights leaders once called home. The restaurant is always innovating new ways to connect with their clientele, hosting backyard movie screenings, live music sessions, and even having DJs entertain their guests as they wait to dine. Atlanta Breakfast Club is a shining example of a Black-owned business that's not only thriving, but expanding and creating opportunities for so many in the process. Their success is due to a culmination of tremendous leadership teamwork, hospitality, and great food. So support a hustler and check out Atlanta Breakfast Club for yourself and read the full story at julianvirgin.com.